Hey Aquarius, welcome back to Star of the Universe Tarot. We are doing your April 2022 reading. If you do not follow me on Instagram, feel free to. I go live every Sunday for week ahead readings. I also go live for the new moon and the full moon readings if you are interested. Those are always by element. If you are looking for zodiac specific messages, I will always be here on YouTube. So make sure to like, share, comment, and subscribe, especially if the content is relatable. If not, that's totally cool. Take what resonates and leave the rest behind. Or if it does not resonate and you have to leave the whole video behind, that's also totally cool. Just go ahead and go through my playlist. I got plenty of um, timeless, countless um, content, whatever, whatever you know you're guided to. I also have twin flame readings and what demon is attached to your karmic and why for my conspiracy theory people out there because those usually end up being like really government um, oriented. All right. Also, you guys, I am on TikTok now, Stars Universe 777, if you want to see collective, short collective messages. Okay. Let's see what's going on. Okay. Woo. That one slid over twice. We have keeping up immense effort and advance. You are rare and free. Lead the way and then a moment's regret. You have five, the Five of Cups energy under the deck. So somebody is regretting the way they treated you here, Aquarius, or you are um, definitely going through some kind of reminiscing here about um, some opportunity that was missed in the past. You thought that you were going to get some kind of ships coming in, um, and I feel like you were even very aggressive about the way that you were trying to make sure that you brought this ships into shore is kind of like what I'm seeing here, but something still fell off last minute. Um, you could be dealing with a Scorpio, but I feel like you did your best to kind of show others how it was done and even went as far as ask for help, but something still did not um, go exactly your way, Aquarius. That's why keeping up. Some of you guys may have um, applied for an advance or something like that. Um, or you're waiting for an advance. Okay. Yeah, you have soul family here in the reverse. And deep replenishment in the reverse. Yeah, you thought that somebody was going to give you some type of inheritance here. It could be a family member here that passed on. I think that, but um, something ended up happening here where... I think that with deep replenishment and the reverse retreat, rest and be held, you, you didn't read the fine print. You rushed into signing something or you rushed into some kind of commitment here that backfired. And with the mirror here, it's because you actually, I feel like you were, I feel like you, you jumped into a contract with the karmic person here. Um, could be a Gemini here, a lot of, a lot of Gemini energy. Uh, it doesn't have to be though. There's Pisces energy as well and Scorpio But basically this person triggered the fuck out of you and I feel like this person Triggered both the light and the dark attributes in yourself and you It's almost like you couldn't figure out who you were for a little bit Because this person with don't dim your light to fit in was projecting so hard their insecurities onto you because they thought that if they could project these insecurities of themselves onto you they would not seem so like all their insecurities like they feel untrustworthy they feel like they cannot um handle certain situations you could be dealing with the cancer but this person wanted to move aside so that you could take over Aquarius, but what ended up happening was that this person was kind of forced into this leadership position So once this person was forced into this leadership position you were left behind They weren't going to be dealing with any inconsistencies here um, Some of you guys um, I'm not gonna lie to you with the ace of cups that they're high they're highlighting here in the moments regret and the three of cups Some of them even left you for a third party here or even try to bring in a third party into this situation. But they started a whole ass new relationship while still dealing with this contract with you.
Yeah, the Page of Cups here. You know what? Um, Aquarius, some of you guys, if you're dealing with the child, some of you guys had some kind of um, family... Somebody, somebody, somebody in your family tried to take your child away. Okay, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Oh, it could have been a Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpio, Aquarius, uh, with the Page of Cups here, uh, or, or the Five of Cups. But they regret trying to take that route because I feel like somebody is now being investigated for their own mistakes with covering the. Yeah, look. Oh my God. Okay, look. With the moments regret painting the roses red here and nonsense. You could be dealing with the Libra, an Aries, or a Taurus, but somebody was an Empress in the reverse that could not manifest, and they were trying to cover up the fact that they could not manifest. How did they do that? They ended up employing, employing, uh, yeah, like either, either, um, like hiring somebody aside from you when you had a partnership trying to fill already. Or there was a partnership already and then this person took another partnership. Whether that is in a relationship, like romantically, or in a business, um, I'm not quite sure. But definitely somebody against their higher guidance with the, with the Page of Cups here offered their love and stability somewhere else. And I feel like somebody took their financial stability towards someone else. Clarify um, the Page of Cups and the Soul Family in the reverse. Yeah, you got the Empress in the reverse. And we got the Empress in the reverse right here, painting the roses white in the... And it's time to talk some sense. This person tried to make it seem like you were an unfit mother or you were an unfit partner. Um, if, whether this is a relationship or... Um, a baby mama or a baby daddy that you're you're divorcing from or this is a, a partnership that you're trying to find yourself out of legally um this person went in for the kill they went in fully knowing that they were going to take advantage of you they saw you as a fool here you could be dealing with an aries um an aqua or a pisces but with the four of wands here they only wanted your stability they wanted you for money they knew they were going to break your heart in the long run. That's why you were so triggered and that's why you wanted this person to take the lead because you wanted to make sure that this person was leading you to success when they were only leading themselves to success. King of Pentacles here. You could be dealing with a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn, but somebody was definitely in their ego. I'm getting a lot of Emperor energy from this King of Pentacles. This person was only thinking about the money. They didn't care about you. They didn't care about you. They were, you were just another burden with the two of wands here. You you could be an Aries or have some Aries placements here. But you're getting higher guidance here, Aquarius, that this person was ready, was willing and ready to leave you in the dust whenever it called for. This person was only nice to you be, when they needed to be nice to you with the Knight of Cups here. This person only offered you love when they needed to pretend that they loved you. Like that, and, and you really close your eyes to this for a very long time, Cancer energy, until that shit bit you in the ass, Scorpio energy. You went from the Three of Cups to the Five of Cups really quick. You guys were celebrating together, but you guys were, you were really closing your eyes to the toxic energies that were going around, which led to the Four of Cups. And now that you've missed your opportunity to jump out when you had the chance, when the, um, when the universe tried to give you a way out with the waves here in the cup, you decided to stay and now you regret it. Now you regret it because this person was never filling you with healing. This person was filling you with anxiety, with envy, with... I feel like this person ultimately tried to make you feel less than Aquarius, and they did. I think it really did work, where you were just this pastime, the flavor of the week energy. Yeah, and they were juggling you the entire time. You could be dealing with a Capricorn, two pentacles. Final messages for Aquarius, please. You have the Sisters of Light, and then you have the Empress of Pearl that came out. I'm telling you, 33, this person definitely had third parties after third party after third party here. And you were just the main one with the Empress of Pearl. 
but they were just they they this person really wanted you as this empress in the reverse here they wanted you needy and clingy to them i think that at some point this person wanted you to fall off your job even just to make sure that you could depend on them but that's not what happened because god actually had a better plan for you so i feel like you really need to thank god for that aquarius because this person almost left you without a job or without a, a financial means of of um moving forward you could have been dealing with a very heavy narcissist here number 33 10 sisters of light you are an advanced soul and you have lived many incarnations shown your light through many different faces your soul has learned many skills in past lives, developed abilities, and talents. This lifetime is accumulating is a culminating lifetime in the sense that your soul is drawing together potencies developed over many lifetimes into unified expression. So if you could not for the life of you pinpoint where the deceit was coming from because after the six of swords it's the seven of swords aquarius you know this you cannot pinpoint where the deceit was coming from it's coming from this person this is why you're so highly triggered you can't trust this person to lead you this person's going to lead you into financial debt with the king of pentacles and the six of swords here this person's going to travel you until and, and bleed you out dry this lifetime is, is a culminating lifetime in the sense that your soul is drawing together potencies developed over many lifetimes and unified expression. If you do not, if you fail this test, you will reincarnate again. It is like drawing on the power of the ten sisters or more into your one current lifetime. Be prepared to grow and shine, beloved. Do not let this person keep you from reaching your glow up because you're almost there. Almost there. Like heavy emphasis on, on Tiana vibes, heavy emphasis on the princess and the frog, like frogs represent detox here. If you are deaf, if you're dealing with any kind of drinking, drugging, anything like that, you definitely want to let that go, especially for the month of April. Aquarius, because something's happening. One, two, three, four, as I was, as I was saying that something for your higher guidance, divine intervention is coming through to make sure that this person does not take advantage of you. I'm hearing you're welcome <laughs> what can i say but hey you're welcome there's a lot of disney um energy in your in your reading aquarius so there's going to be a lot of that um going on as far as indicators for you all right okay that's what i have for you i hope this helps bye